So in a season where the refs have really built up a lot of tension with fans and the media and have been criticized more than ever, Roger Goodell's so-called better than ever officiating crew blew the end of the Lions vs Cowboys game and this was a huge game in the playoff race and it's pretty unacceptable. And the most annoying thing is that it's completely preventable, cause it's completely understandable that everyone out there is human and can make mistakes, but why with the technology we have is that not something you can go back and take a look at and make right? Before I get into everything in this video, I would really appreciate it if you would drop a like and subscribe. It only takes 5 seconds, plus you can always change your mind. We are on the road to 20k subscribers, and your support truly means the world. Alright, so I'm sure by now most of you already know everything that happened in this game, but in case you didn't watch, basically, the Cowboys were in control of things all game long and went up by 7 with under 2 minutes left. But Jared Goff and the Lions put together an incredible drive to score a touchdown. And you already know with Dan Campbell as their coach, they were going to go for two and try to steal the game right there. And they ran a beautiful play, but the ref made a mistake of which player was eligible and flagged them for it. I definitely think it was dumb that Dan still had the team go for two after this, but this was still just crazy to see that officiating can just decide a game like that. And you can clearly see that Taylor Decker did go over to the ref and report as eligible. And I also know before the game that they probably most likely explained the scenarios where they might do that too. This was already a big enough game in the year to be a huge deal, but I just hope that the NFL does something to make sure that this doesn't happen in the playoffs. Again, there is just too much technology around to let human errors determine the outcome of games. And even earlier in this game, in the drive before, the officials called tripping on the offense when in reality, it was Aiden Hutchinson who really tripped, causing the Cowboys to not get a first down that would have pretty much put away the game. In the post game, this is what Jared Goff and Dan Campbell had to say. Explanation you got on the two point. 70 reported. And did Decker report as well? Yeah, the explanation was 70 reported. Did Decker report? Yes. Uh, pretty confused. Um, what I do know, and I don't know if I'll get fined for this, but I do know that Decker reported. I do know that Dan Skipper did not. And I do know that they said that Dan Skipper did. So you can definitely tell they obviously were not happy about things. And this was a big game in terms of having a chance to get the one seed and a first round bye. But the Lions already clinched the NFC North, and they might even get to see Dallas in round one of the playoffs, so they still can get their revenge when it actually matters. And talking more about Dan Campbell, I love him as a coach, and so does everyone, but man he has balls. And I can't believe he still went for two at the 7 yard line. That's just one of those calls where if it works you're a genius, but if it doesn't you're a clown. But I just think in terms of the flow of the game, after dealing with a blown call like that, and being backed up all the way to the 7, you should just take the point and go win it in overtime but let me know what you guys think that's really all i have to say for this video thank you all so much if you made it to this point and if you enjoyed and haven't yet please make sure to drop a like and subscribe because your support really does mean everything also let me know what you would like to see next and until then i will see you all later